of Showworks Media. And in this video and webinar, I'm going to demonstrate to you how you can increase your credibility, reputation, and trust through the power of authorship. And so what I'm gonna to do to give you some context is show you a true innovation that we've developed here at Showworks Media that allows you to actually build your own custom publishing and book marketing campaign. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna walk you through the exact services that you can choose, but also I'm going to demonstrate the value of those services in the real world. And that is what this webinar will cover. So let's start with the tool itself. So this is a tool that you can access on our website. It's absolutely complimentary. Uh, and what this will allow you to do is to essentially calculate costs around the different types of services that we offer to uh, clients that allow you or that are designed to help you to scale your credibility, reputation, and trust. So the first thing and foremost is book creation. Now, nothing will drive your credibility, reputation, and trust more than being a best-selling author. And to demonstrate that, I'm gonna head on over to uh, my YouTube channel. And the first thing that you'll see here are three of my books. Now, the reason why these books are here is because they drive those things, again, credibility, reputation, and trust more than any other thing. If I had an offer like, you know, a subscribe now, over 2 million downloads, they wouldn't carry the same amount of weight. And to demonstrate that, if I Google my show name or my name, Matt Brown Show, you will see a whole bunch of what I call credibility signals from Twitter accounts to podcasts, uh, to websites, to Amazon books, uh, you name it, uh, other podcasts, podcast tours, book trailers. And this is what I call credibility signals. Because when you look at all these things being offered, audio books, book marketing content, podcast tours, websites, book podcasts, advertising campaigns, SEO articles, social media management, and book trailers and keynotes, all these things drive credibility signals. In other words, if someone was searching for you or your name or your company name, what would they find? In this case, I have a, a website built around my personal brand, The Matt Brown Show. And again, you can see links to my three books and you can start to see how this becomes a system. So no matter where this user or this person searching for me comes in, maybe it's a YouTube channel, maybe it's my website, they will always see the books that are associated with my brand. Another example here is a podcast, right? So when I created uh, this uh, book called Secrets of Fail, uh, which I'll pull up for you here, it was based on uh, essentially interviews that I'd done on my podcast, right? And these are the interviews here. So these are interviews that I did with very successful CEOs and entrepreneurs all about their epic business blunders and their worst failures. And the idea was to really help uh, you know people understand that failure is essential in becoming successful in business. And that actually culminated in this year book, Secrets of Fail, uh, which became a bestseller. Now going back to this thing, books are essential. So you have a story to tell. We believe here at Showworks Media that everybody has at least one book in them, probably more. Um, and so one of the ways that we help you to drive more credibility is to help your book become a bestseller. So this is uh, one of our clients, uh, Simon Taylor, and uh, his book became a bestseller. And the reason why he wanted to become an author was because he wanted to influence his market. So his mission is essentially uh, to protect the world's business data, okay? So this was the book that we created for him. We did it in under 30 days and it became a bestseller. Um, and the reason I can prove this to you uh, is by heading on over to this here page. And if you hit explore our services, you can actually see proof of the impact that this had. So when Simon became a best-selling author, he is now a best-selling author for life, right? No one can ever take that uh, status away from you because that's what drives credibility and influence, speaking engagements, it drives new sales and various other things. Okay, so audiobooks. Now, audiobooks are really important because when you think about uh, the reality of what's happening today from a you know, media consumption perspective is that people are consuming, I think it's like 24.3% of all published books are now consumed on audio. So 
we allow you to create uh, an audiobook or we work with you to create an audiobook in fact if you do a book with us today we'll give you an audiobook version of your book for free that's seven and a half thousand dollars worth of value but the reason why I do audiobooks is because I want to capture the as much attention as I can from a global market so these are two of the audiobooks that you can see here uh, for secrets of influence and secrets of fail now going back to Amazon what you'll see on the right here are essentially Kindle versions right which I can select or paperback versions now if I didn't have an audiobook version two things are happening one is that I'm missing out on additional sales opportunity and two I'm missing out on the opportunity to capture additional attention for people or readers if you really want to learn about the failure the biggest failures of CEOs running 10 billion dollar plus companies uh, but also I'm giving it to them on their own terms in other words an audiobook like this one or any of these really allows my audience to consume my message on their own terms so audiobooks are essential now quickly let's talk about book marketing content so going back to secrets of fail when we actually released um, the uh, book we took all this content right and we repurposed it into over 200 different assets and uh, we seeded them on linkedin uh, on youtube on facebook and various other channels on my podcast as well um, and what this actually generated was eight different podcast interview requests and this was without doing any uh, paid ads at all this is just organic reach and this is um, quickly just an example here of one of the interviews that i did on a podcast uh, called closing time so now here i am talking about my book again secrets of influence which drives my credibility and so uh, what this conversation was all about was about what I know to be true about the context of influence and AI publishing and authorship. And I did over eight of these podcast interviews. And again, uh, what you can see here is that I'm being positioned as an expert. And the reason for that is because when you are being interviewed by anyone about any topic whatsoever, you are automatically the expert. In this case, I'm being uh, interviewed by Chip, the host, about influence and authorship and things like that. And so as a consequence of that, the world sees me as the expert on authorship or AI publishing and influence. But the counter argument is also true. If I was interviewing Chip about uh, CRM systems, he would be the expert. And so this is why podcast tours are so important and the ability to leverage your credibility, reputation and trust through authorship on other shows. Uh, and so that's a really important thing that we do. Now quickly, book websites. So book websites are really important. Why? Because you can build a community around uh, your book. In this case, uh, what I'm also doing is selling additional workshops. So here is a button here called book a workshop where I'm gonna work with leadership teams and so forth. And I charge, you know, $5,000 for an hour's workshop. Or maybe I wanted, uh, you know, do a keynote for $10,000. It's a 45 minute keynote and a 15 minute Q&A but I'm not able to commercialize my book, right, over and above direct book sales if I don't have a book website, right? So that's very important. We work with our clients to help you create, uh, as an example, communities around your book. So you can sell workshops, membership subscriptions, uh, and high value uh, tickets. Now, SEO articles are another important thing that we do. So quickly, what I wanna show you is a platform that we use called Reword. Now, what you're looking at here are essentially SEO optimized articles that we've done for Showworks Media. And what you can see here is the search score, meaning how, um, based on certain keywords, how relevant is this article and how likely is it to index on the first uh, SERP page or search engine results page. You can also see the word count and all that kind of stuff. Um, and what's very powerful about this is that everything we do as a team uses AI. It goes from the uh, content post-production that we do to the SEO articles that we create, everything. And just to give you a quick example of this power, if I click on like what subheadings matter to my readers, I can select that option. And then what I can even do is get AI to write that section for me. So this is how we're able to create an incredibly powerful impact in your business your business in your personal brand through seo related articles and so when you sign up for seo related articles can be over a six month or three month period we give you a set number of articles every month and we use ai and 
proven data to build true SEO optimized articles that capture organic search traffic. Now, quickly about book advertising. If you want to reach 25,000 to 50,000 people with your story, even in the case of Simon Taylor, who reached over 3.6 million people with his book and his story, advertising is essential. So this is an example of what I mean by essential. So if you look at this uh, campaign that we've run for one of our clients, you can actually see the amount of impressions that were generated off a certain ad spend against certain types of roles, business development, entrepreneurship, or industries, real estate, finance, etc. And so when you look at all of these impressions, these are the amount of people that saw the content that we were creating for them to help them market their book and their brand. So as an example, there were 36,000 impressions, meaning 36,000 people saw this particular campaign that we went to market with. And when you add all these numbers together, it is an incredibly powerful way to reach a lot of people. Other things that we are doing, even from a YouTube advertising perspective, is we're targeting specific channels. So for instance, if you've written a book uh, that's related to entrepreneurship or maybe CRM systems uh, or Salesforce related things or what have you, we're able to target people on YouTube that are subscribed to your competitor channels, that are subscribed to uh, other channels that are you know, covering the topic that you are looking to cover. Uh, social media management is another thing that we do. You just don't have the time to manage it all yourself, rather make it someone else's problem. And then book trailers and keynote talks. A lot of our clients want to become professional speakers. And so what I wanted to quickly show you was an example uh, of a book trailer. So take a quick look at this. Uh, it shows you the kind of positioning that we can create by creating something called book trailers. Now, this book trailer that you're about to see here is from my first book called uh, Your Inner Game. Uh, it took me over a year to write, so I'd never another, write another book again. Uh, but it was probably one of the most powerful investments I'd ever made uh, in my personal brand, in my story, and my ability to drive my uh, credibility reputation. Uh, so on the 1st of August, this year inside this box um, is a book. Um, it's called uh, Your Inner Game. Uh, 12 Principles for High Impact Entrepreneurs. <laughs> it's going to be on shelves nationwide. <laughs> Go get it. So that is an example of what we call a book trailer. And so one of the things that we also do are keynotes talk developments. So if you're going to have an actual professional speaking engagement off the back of your book, you've got to have a very well designed and thought through keynote presentation. And so depending on the type of book that you have, it could be a B2B book or maybe it's just an inspirational book, uh, we use different types of frameworks. So we use a P3 framework that's problem, product, and proof. Uh, typically for talks related to B2B problems. And if it's a general book around inspirational, as an example, or whatever it might be, or how to save time or productivity, something more along those lines, we'll use a framework called care, believe, no do. So give them reasons to care, give them reasons to believe, tell them what you want them to know and tell them what you want them to do. And so the structure of information when you do a talk is more important than the information itself. And as a speaker, uh, and having done a lot of speaking in the past, I can tell you that these frameworks are absolutely bulletproof. Um, and that is how, again, speaking professionally at events, you put cameras in the room, uh, like I've done before, uh, and you just take that content and you reseed that again. And so what you're creating is an influence system. It essentially is a number of things like a book, becoming a best-selling book, audiobooks, marketing content, etc., podcasters, all these things, they all culminate together 
to create an influence system that ultimately drives your credibility, reputation, and trust faster and more effectively than any other method out there. And I can attest to you because I've done this from being a podcast host on the Matt Brown Show, which is now in the top 2% of all podcasts that exist uh, globally, through to growing a network, through book podcasts, becoming a best-selling author, audiobooks, podcast tours, book websites, SEO content, uh, you know, book trailers as an example. Uh, all these things come together, book advertising. Um, you know, another thing I wanna touch on quickly are events. Uh, so another thing that's really powerful is, is having a book launch event. Uh, and this is an example of one when I released my first book, Your Inner Game, uh, is we did a live event where I was interviewed by Maps Mappagnani in front of a live audience. Again, I'm being interviewed. I'm not interviewing him. He's interviewing me. And that makes me the expert on that topic. And so this was done in front of a live uh, studio audience. In fact, it was actually done in a bookstore. Um, and it was just a very powerful event that, again, drives my credibility, reputation, and trust. So everything that we offer you as a potential client uh, as part of an engagement with us is proven because I've done it. It's not some pie-in-the-sky thinking thing that maybe will work one day. This will absolutely work. It's the reason why I have so much credibility when anybody Googles my name. And that is how you drive your credibility, your credibility faster than anything else out there. And so that concludes the end of this video, guys. If you'd like to play around with your own custom publishing campaign to see what it might take um, or to cost and what you get with everything, you can also click on these articles or on these images. And what they will show you is a detailed breakdown of exactly what goes into all of these different services and how we're able to use these mechanics to scale your credibility, reputation, and trust. My name is Matt signing out, and we'll see you again soon, I'm sure.